Hello, I'm Nick with Triplet Test Equipment and Tools. Today I'm going to talk about a product that's been very popular with us lately. It's a very great product to do troubleshooting on cable. It's our Triplet TDR. This, uh, our TDR comes with a nice condor case, Velcro belt loop on the back, comes with the main unit with a detachable BNC to alligator clip adapter, the 9 volt battery which has already been installed, and the product manual. So you may be wondering what a TDR is. A TDR is a cable fault locator. Um, some of the unique features on this particular unit is that it can actually find the fault to a cable from one end. You don't need to have another um, adapter on the other end of the cable to tell you how long the cable is or the distance to the fault. So this product does a few different things. It has 39 different cables built into it so you can test a variety of different types of communication cables. Um, I'm going to show you a demonstration by using a Cat5 cable um, unshielded in a few moments. But the, some of the nice things is that it has 39 different cables in it, so it will probably have the cable that you have. If you don't have, if the cable's not listed in here, all you need to do is find the, your cable's VP, um, the velocity propagandum. Um, you can find that out by looking up the cable manufacturer on your cell phone or on your laptop, and you can find that out very easily. It should be listed underneath their specs. And once you have that, you can go down, it may be hard for you to see, but you can go down through the menu of the 39 different cables, and then towards the bottom, there is a VP that starts at 100% and it goes all the way down to 0%. So you can figure out which one works best for you. So the reason why we have this alligator clip adapter is, is that you can see that there's a traditional BNC up on the top. The traditional BNC is for coax cables, BNC type cables. You can plug it directly in. With this adapter, it allows you to do multi-cable cables like this uh, Cat5 cable that we're going to be showing you in a little bit. Some of the other nice features, it runs on a nice simple 9 volt battery. And it's a very easy to use product. It's simply got three buttons on it. You just choose the cable you want to do, you press the one cable, it does a quick snapshot. Um, one of the re couple of reasons why you would want to test the length of the cable is that, well, what we're trying to demonstrate here is actually how much cable you got left in the box. Um, you go into a job site, you know you're going to need 500 foot of line, and you got a box of this in the back, you're not sure if you have 500 feet or 1,000 feet or 200 feet. So this is a great tool to do some inventory purposes on that. Another great reason for this product is, okay, you have a fault in the cable, you know there's something wrong with it, it's not working properly. Well, this product will tell you the distance to that short to that break. So that makes it very easy for you to locate the cable and try to fix the problem. Another nice feature of this is that it actually produces a tone. So if uh, when you're doing the cable and it's plugged in, it actually sends out a tone down the cable that you can use an inductive probe like our, like our Hound 3 or Hound Junior to trace it to the fault itself. So now that I've told you a little bit about the product, I'm going to hook this up and kind of show you the demonstration. So first, I'll put on the adapter, and then I'll scroll through. I'm going to, it's going to take a second to scroll through. So I'm going to scroll through until I hit Cat5 Unshielded. Okay, Unshielded. So the way that you're going to do this test is that you'll strip to the bare wires, doesn't matter which ones they are, and you'll connect one to the other and one to the other one. Um, there's no particular order or whatsoever, you just need to have it on bare copper wire. So once you have it hooked up, you press the button, and once you're holding the button down, it'll actually give you the test, and it'll say length, because it doesn't find a short in the cable. If it said it found a short, it would actually say short on there. So for the length, it says 729 feet is left in this 1,000 uh, thousand foot box of cable. That's very good information, so as you're doing inventory type purposes. As you can see, it's a very simple and easy product to use, but it could be definitely a lifesaver in trying to figure out how much cable you have in the inventory when you go to the job site and also trying to do troubleshooting. Well, if you have any more questions about the TDR, please visit us on our website at www.triplet.com or visit us on our Facebook. Thank you for watching this video, and I hope you have a great day.